they just dropped the all Madden player randomly. They didn't even announce it. They didn't even reveal it. They just dropped it. That's all. They literally just dropped it. And Ken Stabler is our quarterback here today. I'm going to show you guys this card. He's the best quarterback in the game. I don't even have to say anything. I already know, but we're going to get a gameplay with him nonetheless. But if you guys enjoy gameplays like this, make sure to hit that like, hit that sub, boys. We're on the road to 30,000 subscribers. And also, I do stream on Twitch every single day at 1 p.m. Eastern. But other than that, let's get into the gameplay. Before we start today's video, I wanted to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, MuttPacks.com. You can click the link down below and open exciting packs, win tons of coins, and withdraw your account right away. You could use promo code CHU for 15% off. Lastly, when you sign up down below, you can get a free 10,000 coin pack as well. Boys, Ken Stabler, stat-wise, he looks just like every other 98, 99 quarterback in the game. And if you guys are wondering how you got this, you had to put in your free Rob Gronkowski, your free, uh, I can't remember the first guy, the first Dave Casper and also Deion Sanders from playing the game in all the seasons. But... That's not what we're looking at right here. We're looking at the abilities, boys. He gets the God stack. These four are known as the quarterback God stack for three AP. For example, the other quarterbacks in the game that get the God stack are Brady and Mahomes, and they get it for five AP. So he gets it for cheaper, and he also gets Slinger three release, which is arguably the best release in the game. It's the Lamar Jackson release. So yes, on paper, he's already the best. He is a lefty quarterback, though, which does suck. But he also does get some built-in X factors. He gets run and gun right here for one. And also bazooka or dots right here for one as well. So we're going to be rocking 5 AP on him. I'm excited, boys. Let's get right into the game. All right, boys, if you guys are wondering how to get this card for free, because I did put free in the title, and as many of you guys know already, this is the all Madden set player that everybody has been talking about forever. We've been wondering who we're getting, and they've been talking about it on their, on their streams as well. But here he is right here. It's basically, if you guys do not know, you have to put in the Deion Sanders, the Gronk, and also Dave Casper from Season 1, Season 2, and Season 3. I already did it right here, and if it's showing, if you have them and it's not showing, all you got to do is downgrade them, but you do get them all back as well as you'll see we do have Rob Gronkowski in the gameplay but yeah just because I know some people will be confused on the free part it is right there and it's very easy to get or you really can't get it anymore I wouldn't be surprised if EA puts a paid away like kind of get in you guys know how they did with like the I can't think of his name the corner Tariq Woolen I wouldn't be surprised if they did that but if you have your cards, it's right here. All right, boys, there he is. Brand new Ken Stabler, 99 overall all Madden card in the top three. And this guy doesn't have me. I know it's like brand, brand new. Like the chat, I was just streaming. I just ended stream. I was going to record it on stream, but I ended it to record it over here on YouTube. But I, it, it literally just dropped, for example. But I am very excited. Let's go see what he looks like. Boys, there he is. This is the, I think this is the first time I've ever seen him in Madden. I'm not 100% sure on that. In the time I've played Madden, this is definitely the first time I've seen him. But a lefty quarterback with Slinger 3. Basically, if you guys do not know, this is kind of like Leon Sandcastle with much better AP. He gets everything, even the Gunslinger. So basically, a much better Leon Sandcastle. And I think the reason why they chose him, I know a lot of people are going to be like, who's this guy? Who's this? Yada, yada. I think a lot of the people in the chat were telling me that he was John Madden's quarterback. So that does does make a lot of sense out here and i think we're gonna have bo jackson right there in front of the safety let's go boys he's officially in dollar which i was not ready for at all but look at that's where he's like amazing at that quick release is amazing with slinger three especially in that medium range all right i wonder if we can get this bomb down the left side we just got to not get blitzed right here boys let's see and i think we are gonna have him wide open can we get in for the touchdown and Harold Carmichael, Ken Stabler leading a perfect drive. We already knew what we were getting with him. With uh, Basically, like I said, he is Le Leon Sandcastle with an endgame build. I don't know how quarterbacks can really get better than Ken Stabler later in the year. Like, he has the God stack for 3 AP. Are they going to start giving us the God stack for 1 or 2 AP in the future? Because this is about as end game as you can get. This is better than golden ticket abilities last year. All right, boys, we are playing that gun deuce close. Very good run formation and solid passing formation. And look who he has, the quad father. But we have secure tacklers everywhere. Brand new Derwin as well. I have too many secure tacklers on the field to be running the ball, you know? I, I think all five of these guys right here in the box do have it. And I missed right there. I'm guessing this guy is a quad father only guy. News is though, if he keeps running that trap play, we should be absolutely perfect. And there we go. That should have been, is that not a tackle for loss? I'm not too sure. Nope, he still has it. That is definitely tough. But if he keeps running the ball like this, we'll definitely slow him down. And it looks like he is literally only, all right. In my head, I'm like, okay, I know how to stop it, but I'm not going to like sell out if I don't think he's running. I guess he's literally only running it, which... I guess makes sense if you're not the best passer in the world. That's the work you could do when you know it's coming, right? Like, if you run it again right here. All right, so literally, okay. All right, so he literally only runs. Wow. 
I have to pinch my defense against this guy no matter what because he could literally run in third and 12. I wouldn't be surprised if he ran a trap right here. And look at it underneath. Good hit. Here comes the fourth. All right, boys. I have no clue. He's running the trap. And there goes Tank, man. Tank came in free. Hey, if we can score right here again against the runner, we're in a great spot. The only problem with running, like, you got to, like, know a couple. I mean, he only passed the ball once that drive. He didn't even really give himself a chance. He kind of is just depending that uh, I'd have, like, bad, bad user. You know what I mean? But... Hey, we'll take a stop like that every single day, boys. And we're going to just take our dump downs like that. If he's going to keep running dollar, hey, we'll take our dump downs. All right, I actually thought he was going to come out in dollar again, and I called the play that I don't think is going to be very, very successful right now. But you never know. You truly, truly never know in this game. And yeah, nothing really of success right there. I, I'm going to be honest. He's kind of playing really random right now. Now he went to dollar as well again. So we got to be ready for him coming out in anything. Accidentally turned shoe clock on, so I have no time to set up my blocking in dollar. So I'll just take my little dink and dunk run. Hey, we did score on this bomb last time. Surely he has to know it's coming, right? Out of dollar. Let's see. Did he adjust out of it? He did. He did. And oh, we almost got sacked, but that release is fast. We have to finish setting up the Blix protection here. He's obviously blitzing everybody. And look at Jamar Chase, boys. This release, absolute butter, boys. Absolute butter. It's nasty. All right, we're going to go for a quick snap right here and see if we can get ourselves a wide open touchdown over the middle or maybe even A. I think A, kind of risky, but look at Rob Gronkowski. You got, if you're going to run dollar like that, you have to make a lot of adjustments. That defense by itself, DB Fire, is probably one of the worst defenses in the game. All you got to do is quick snap it. But if they start doing crazy adjustments, it's pretty hard to play against. All right, boys, there's no way he keeps on running what he ran last drive, right? The, just the trap? I guess he is. I mean, this trap is probably one of the easiest runs in the game to shoot. Eight rushes for 28 yards. A hey, tank is back lit up as well. We are looking very juicy out here, boys. And he ran again, man. What are we doing? There's no way he runs right here, right? He could. He very well could, and he's not going to. And look at brand new Watson. We put him in a vert hook right there. And it looks like we're going to end the game right there, boys. Oh. That could have been a fumble. I did not mean to do that bad animation, boys. Hey, we'll take a 21-point lead, though. And there goes the rage quick. Ken Stable, you can see his picture right there. He looks really good. We got blitzed a lot that game. He looks amazing. All right, boys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Ken Stabler is definitely the best quarterback in the game. I truly feel like, like how could anybody be better, right? He gets the cheapest AP. He has the, one of the best releases in the game. Some people even call it the best release in the game. He's fast. What's wrong with him? Like, you know what I mean? Like, he's the best. He simply is the best. He was free as well. Hopefully, you guys got your season one, season two, and season three masters. And hopefully, you guys were able to do the set because he is insane. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure that like, hit that comment, hit that sub, all the yada. You know, you know the deal on YouTube, boys. We're on that road to 30K, boys. I appreciate you guys. Hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace out, boys.